extremely big wins. Obviously, winning the BMW and uh, uh, winning at Eastlake and, and the FedEx Cup. Uh, I think we have four of the last six FedEx Cup winners on our team. So, you know, again, these are these are positives that I'll be talking to the guys about and keep pumping them up. But as I said, we won't uh, take the U.S. lightly. They're a very strong team, and we uh, we're still hurting from two years ago. You know, I think we have 12 very hot players, to be honest. You know, we're three of the top four in the world. We have uh, some young some young guys that uh, are trying to make their mark, Ludwig and Nikolai. And I think the, the future for them is bright. And we have a lot of other major champions, you know, Shane Lowry, uh, Justin Rose, that's Fitzpatrick. Uh, it goes on and on. So, you know, we have a very strong team. And uh, we know we're up against it with the U.S. They're, they're very strong as well. But uh, I'm very happy with my 12. Yeah, we've we've known about Ludwig for a long time. He's obviously um, number one amateur in the, in the world in college, and um, you know his credentials are, would have been very similar to a John Rahm or a Victor Hovland, who in the last 20 years who who played in college. So he he obviously came out to the professional circuit and picked it up pretty quickly. Some very strong finishes, and then winning in Kran a couple of weeks ago. So. I think uh, the future is very bright for him. Um, he's a tremendous driver of the golf ball, which is really a, a strength uh, around Marco Simone, and he's already fitting in very well with the team.